look at what they put on the Apple Store, a giant Vision Pro. I love New York, I love New York. I love New York. It's Vision Pro launch day here at New York City's flagship Apple Store. There's a crowd gathered to pick up their pre-orders. The first person in line had a pre-order, but they still got here at 9.30 p.m. the night before. Folks here also don't have something to pick up. They just want to be part of this whole event and get a demo if they can. Let's go. This new product launch is a big deal. So of course they are getting fans energized. Apple CEO Tim Cook greeted the first Apple Vision Pro customers at the Fifth Avenue Cube. There was lots of cheering and lots of selfies. There was even a customer who brought a shirt for laughs. It was a good morning for fans on all coasts when stores opened at 8 a.m. to release the long-awaited headset. I've been an Apple fangirl since, well, 20 years more for a long time. I've gotten the first iPhone on the first day of introduction every year since they were first introduced. Over in California, customers that visited the Palo Alto store near Apple's headquarters could meet some of the team that worked on the headset. And I got it all autographed by all the amazing team that worked on it. This is, this is a beautiful device. I'm loving the energy here today. Tim Cook is talking to customers, taking selfies, really spending a lot of time with the first people to own the Vision Pro. There's also Greg Joswiak, and everyone here is just taking their time to really absorb this moment. Many Apple stores have been transformed to include these cozy seated nooks to demo the headset. Demos are on a first come, first serve basis. There is a bit of a wait to get a demo, and I think they expected that. That's why they have all these little stations here to let you have something to tinker with while you wait. So this kind of takes you through like a basic lesson in what it can do. And you can book a demo right from this iPad. There's literally someone here to demo at any hour of the day. 2 a.m. first appointment. <laughs> For this first big rush, it's a first come first serve basis. But really, you can go down to an Apple store and talk to someone if there's availability to get your own demo. When it's your turn for a demo, the headset is hand delivered on a platter for your personal walkthrough. To get the right fit, customers can get their head size scanned by an iPhone, and there are these drawers around holding various sized light seals and cushions. There's also a procedure to clean all of the head pieces between uses. If you wear eyeglasses, you're gonna need special lenses inserted to be able to see inside the Vision Pro. And to get the right lens match for your eyes, your eyeglasses are put into this machine and it reads your prescription. The staff brings out compatible lens inserts, but this is just for the demo experience. You cannot order prescription lenses inside the store. That is all done online. All right, here's a gentleman who has two Vision Pros plus travel cases. Second one is a surprise, so I don't want that leaking out before I get back home. All right, tell me about your demo experience. I think the uh, all the immersive stuff, the immersive videos, the spatial uh, memories that, that they have was even more impactful than you can imagine before seeing it. Some demonstrations are also done while sitting at tables with customers. And the team certainly needed to do a lot of demos because it was a pretty packed house today. I, I thought it would be unlikely there would be any in store. Mine's coming on February 27th. And so I was like, well, if it's, if it's, I looked on the website and it said nothing's available, but I was like, let me just walk over to the store and see what happens. And then like, if you don't have an order, you can just line up here and buy one. So I just canceled my pre-order and just bought it. <laughs> this was a pretty exciting day. My big takeaway is that they really let customers take their time with their Vision Pro experience. There was no rushing anyone out, even though lots of people want to be able to see this thing, they were able to accommodate a lot of people, and that was pretty cool that everyone got to take their time with it. Do you plan on going to an Apple store to try it out? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching.